Welcome to Saturday's Taste Test. <laughs> it's us again. <laughs> Yay, it's the group. This week, uh, we are addressing one of your biggest problems, which is I don't have time to eat. So for this week, we decided to do breakfast on the go. And what we did was got a bunch of different types of oatmeal cups that you can grab and go. You just heat them up 45 to 60 seconds in the microwave and you're on your way. Two of these we actually decided to try as overnight oats instead of hot oats just to compare how it tastes. Um, if you would like to start, so this first one we're gonna do is an overnight oat. This is purely Elizabeth. This one I'm excited about. Do you wanna add, it actually comes with a granola topping in it as sure, well. Do you sure, wanna, we, we would add it. Do you wanna add that in? Um, all of these aren't a huge breakfast, so I'll just start with that. The calories are only 190 to 250 calories per cup, so probably not enough to keep you full for very long. You may want to add something or just consider it a snack. Um, if you eat one of these, you probably, your stomach's not going to be full for long. Uh, whoopsies. <laughs> So I love overnight oats. You probably see me. I eat these every day. My own homemade version. Uh, very bland. Oh, okay. Very bland. I don't. I don't like cold either. I'm not a cold person. I guess. Mm. Yeah, it needs a little bit of flavor, but I like it. I mean, I would definitely eat this if I needed something to just like grab and get in the car and eat. I am uh, not. You're not. <laughs> That's fine. It does need a little... You know what? I bet you could do some cinnamon. Yeah. Do some cinnamon in there. I bet that would help. I think the, the stuff you're supposed to add in was supposed to add that, and it didn't really add it. The crunch? Yeah. I don't mind this, actually. I like the ingredients on this one a lot because it's all clean ingredients. Oats, flaxseed, um, chia seeds, hemp seeds. These are all things that I would put in my own overnight oats. So I see myself using this when I travel, especially when I might not have access to make my own overnight oats, I would definitely grab this, take it back to the hotel and <laughs> use it as a healthy snack. All, All right. right, we'll try another overnight oats. This um, is the chocolate flavored. This is the RX brand, which I love this brand um, because all their ingredients are clean. You can pronounce them. There's nothing tricky in there. Um, so we are doing a hot oats and it a cold like coffee. Oats. It does smell like coffee. It's chocolate. Chocolate flavor. Mm -mm. Doesn't taste chocolatey. Definitely coffee. Oh yeah, it's got. Is it the dates? Oats, almonds, dates, egg whites, chocolate, sea salt. No, it totally smells like coffee and tastes like coffee. It does smell like coffee. Oh, that's interesting. It's better than the other one to me. It's got more flavor to it. It's crunchy because it has the almonds in there too, mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. actual almonds, which gives it a crunch. Yeah, that, I don't love coffee, so I'm not a huge fan of that. That's weird because it's supposed to be chocolate. Yeah, no, that's odd. Better than the other one again. Not sure how good I am. Cold. <laughs> yeah, I'm more of the, the overnight oats than he is. Um, okay, so if you're traveling, you're in a hotel, and you have one of these that, you know, you can grab at the convenient mart at the hotel, would you try these? So try okay. up first for hot. We've got Think brand. I'm on this the is road. a peanut butter brand. I will just give a quick note. If you're heating it up in your microwave, put it on a plate because it never fails, that it overflows, and then you've got oatmeal all over your microwave. So this helps, you can see some of the remnants of the oatmeal that came across there. Ooh, that's good. You like that? Yep. <clears throat> yep, I'll eat that. Mmm. Ooh, that's really good. Mm -hmm. I would have that in the morning, absolutely. Peanut butter honey flavor. It's got 10 grams of protein and five grams of fiber. Only 190 calories. Usually my breakfast is around 500, so it doesn't quite meet that. But if you're on the go and you're running out the door, I mean, this would be great. Well, and, and you know, your hotel typically is not going to have this stuff. So if you could pack that for a couple mm -hmm. days, like if you're gone for a couple mornings, yeah, why not? Go down, fill it up, and microwave it downstairs. That'd be good. Absolutely. I agree. If you don't want the really bad sausage. And oh, God, those buffets at the hotels are so disgusting. Ugh. 
Oh, that was good. Oh, the eggs. I think I might get sick of the same thing. Okay. Uh, here we go. You can try a bite. Okay, I didn't know if we were going to talk about it. Sure. So this is the um, apple cinnamon flavor. So as I was cooking this one in the microwave, oh my gosh, it smells so good. You could smell the apple and the cinnamon coming through on that. Again, the RX brands, very clean ingredients, which I like. You know what you're eating. Um, I, mean, I don't know if it's because you didn't put enough water in it, but it's really... Yeah, I don't think I put enough water in that one, so that's my fault. Because it's really It may be a little dry. Most of these do have a fill line in here. It shows you where to fill the water to, um, but I may have, you could probably see it better in this one. I may not have put enough water in it. Water, no water. That one's not as good as the last one. Great cinnamon smell, no mm -hmm. cinnamon taste. Yeah, get the apple in there, but no cinnamon. You're right. Mm -hmm. So maybe put a little of your own cinnamon on it. Probably. Hmm. But again, why do you have to do that? I mean, I'm not carrying cinnamon, cinnamon around. But... <laughs> You're in a hotel. <laughs> Can you please empty your bag out, sir? What is this bag of cinnamon? <laughs> this one's actually 250 calories, though. So a little bit more uh, to help keep you full. Wow. Next up is just your plain, basic, uh, organic, plain, plain oatmeal. So I wanted to see, I'm going to guess it doesn't have much flavor. I don't um, know. Mabel likes it. I've been feeding her. <laughs> Well, if the dog likes it, then, you know, it must be good. Mm, yeah. Oh. Bland. Mm -hmm. It looks good, though. It's nice and thick. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, smells like oatmeal. I mean, I guess. You need to add stuff to that, though. What That's... would you add to it? Um, brown cinnamon, sugar. <laughs> brown sugar. Everything. I mean, everything. It's just bland. But again. It's perfect, though, for oatmeal. If, if you, you want oatmeal on the go. If you like oatmeal, you want oatmeal on the go. It's 210 calories. You know what you're getting. It's not in that big vat that they have at a hotel buffet that it's like, oh, you don't know how long it's been sitting there. Yes, yes, I see. Um, just a quick macro update. So these have four to nine grams of fat, carbs 30 to 37, fiber four to six grams, and then protein seven to 14. So I feel like they're all pretty similar. You can make them work with whatever your daily caloric intake is. Mm. This is the um, Kodiak cake, oatmeal, that's, peanut butter, chocolate chip. That's my favorite. Really? And you can see when you're mixing it up, the contents in there, real contents of the peanut butter and everything in there. Mm. Yeah, that was good. That is really good. Yep. How did the ingredients... And, and when I was mixing it, you could see it mixing see. all up in there. Yeah, that looked really good. Whole grain oats. Oh, well, guess what the second ingredient is. Well, semi whatever. semi-sweet chocolate sugar. Um, pea protein concentrate, which is surprising because yeah. we normally don't like the pea protein. Good. Okay. Well, those, those are pretty good, actually. How, how would you rate them? I know you don't like the cold, so that's For the hard. cold, I put those that way. That one first, that one oh, second. Oh, and I would do the opposite. And then I would go this way for, for these. The last one we just had, first one we had, and then this one kind of in the middle because there was some sort of taste to it, and this one there was <laughs> absolutely no taste to it, so. Mabel, what do you think? Do you agree? Mabel really enjoys this one, but this is the only one she had because I don't trust giving anything else that it has on here. None of the chocolate. Um, so I but there were some good options. Go there were good yeah. options for 